Now we'll build a smoke material together. So this is the folder with our smoke. It's time for a little bit practice before starting creating our smoke for the tires. So first I decided to make a normal smoke with you and the material. So here, content drawer, right button, new material. And you can name it like SM, like smoke. Okay. Let's click twice and I will bring it to my first monitor. Okay. Here on the left side, you will see this is empty. So first you have to click here and here to click and to change it to translucent. And now some of them will be disabled. Another one will be enabled. First, let's bring our textures. We'll use two textures to build this material. So first one, this is the main texture with the animation of the smoke. And I will use another texture, which is only for the color of our smoke. So yeah, first our two textures, you can place them with drag and drop from the content drawer inside directly in the material. So here, let's click A on your keyboard and left button of your mouse. And you will add this add setting here in our uh, window. So after that, we will need one multiply node. So clicking M on your keyboard and again, left button of your mouse, you will add the multiply. So here, what we have to do, we have to connect A with A here and here this one with A of the multiply. Now let's continue. We need to click here the right button of your mouse, right texture coordinate. Let's see. Uh, texture coordinate it's important and to connect it with the uvs of this white color so it's just a texture of a smoke with white color inside and it's helping here the main texture and of course we have to uh, add here a particle color node which will allow to make corrections inside the color inside Niagara. so particle oops not this one particle color here and we have to connect it the RGB with B here and this RGB also with this one here another multiply again holding M on your keyboard left button of your mouse okay like that and this A will be with A here and A here with the B here so now let's add a clump clump here let's add it here and now it's time to connect the multiplayer here to the base cover and clump here to the bust and we can add one depth of fade here okay depth of fade and to add it here to connect them together again and depth fade here we can write something uh like between 100 and 200 so i will keep it 100 here okay and our material for the smoke it's ready after that you have to click save and you can see our smoke it's here and this will be the smoke which we will use inside niagara 